Uh, yeah, I have volunteered for one. I don't mean to brag, um, but uh, it does. It feels like it's kind of a, a community-centered venue, and so I, I, do, I feel like I like to help and uh, attend a bar, which I did when I was in college and stuff, and I like doing because um, I can socialize without actually having to socialize. But. Um, yeah, it's it's just it's always a fun venue. The whatever show she's putting on is generally pretty great, and so I like just helping out however I can. And for me, being from a family of nine, um, when something has to happen, you know, it's just you just come in and do it. You know, you help serve, serve the food, you take tickets, you. I talk to other people in town to know that they know what's happening on, happening here. So that's kind of what I do, is just whatever needs to happen, it needs to happen. Yeah, I would agree with that. I think um, in my case that I was, I was more or have been more um, involved in, in getting, either doing specific plays. Um, for example, the first play we did here which was um, The Cherry Orchard by Anton Chekhov. And one of the reasons that I picked that was because that, that play is about a society that's changing and a family that ends up selling off their farm. And there were a lot of people here in this area who have been through that or have sold off parts of their, their land as, as their lives and the world has changed. And I remember the first, that first play that we did uh, one of the people who came to see the play was a man, I, I, I would say in his early 60s, maybe mid 60s even, who had never seen a play in his life. So it was, there was something about um, not just being able to, to have concerts or shows or different events for us, but to try to sort of expand that to the larger community, to people who might not get the opportunity to um, see a lot of those kind of cultural um, cultural opportunities or events that, that speak to all of us. So, um, yeah, one of the things I was able to do was, because of friends in New York, was um, there was, for example, a Brazilian singer and guitarist who was fabulous, who we got up here to play for a weekend, who plays mouth trumpet and was a big hit. Um, so, yeah, I think we all sort of, help out. I mean, I've taken tickets as well. Um, I think we all try to help out in whatever way we can or, or what our relative gifts are. <laughs> and, and other people in the community help out when needed. Yeah. Uh, the Cherry Orchard, wasn't that when the, the actors were up at the, uh, the house? Yeah, the, someone, the, donated someone donated the house. Donated the house and we put beds together so that they could sleep on things and because it was the first time we did that yeah i so, stepped in and played a part <laughs> both of them played a part and didn't you do all the the program I, I, typing I and all that yeah yeah, yeah. so it's, it's it really is a collective in that sense with i think a um a view towards toward towards making our little corner of the world a better place for everyone in it in the ways that we can and trying to include everybody in the yeah. community 